Hi guys, welcome to this video. Uh, I'm just going to be giving you a quick demonstration of some of the mobile apps that are available for Synology disk stations. Um, in this instance I'm using uh, an Apple iPad but these are also available for Android and uh, scaled down versions for the iPhone as well. Uh, so let's start off with DS Finder. Uh, all this is, it's connected to my, my NAS at home. Uh, so you can see you get a breakdown of system information. You can also go through to uh, look at network information and survey storage information as well. Uh, you can also uh, email that information to yourself or to, to someone else. And you can also do things like tell the device to shut down. You can access the web interface. If you hit the Find Me button, I'm not sure if you can hear that, but my disk station is beeping away in the next room. I suppose that's useful if you've got more than one disk station, you need to identify which one you're connected to. Uh, the next app is DS Audio, which as you can imagine is a web interface for the, uh, sorry, an uh, uh, iPad interface for the uh, audio station on the Synology drive. It uh, allows you to scroll through by playlist, artist, album, genre, uh, etc. You get a scroll pane in the left hand window, album artwork for currently playing items, and you get the main pane in the middle. If I just select one of these songs, And it plays back over uh, your LAN connection or over the internet. Uh, all these apps incidentally will work over the internet with a bit of configuration. Uh, next I'll show you the DS file app, which is a very simple file browser. It allows you to view files that are stored on your uh, NAS drive. Uh, and in the case of things like photos, you can preview them, uh, etc. Uh, you can also download files onto your local device. Uh, and it will give you a breakdown of uh, move and change tasks that, you've, that have taken place on your device uh, or on your uh, disk station recently. What haven't we looked at yet? Uh, DS Photo. Uh, it's just an a iPad interface for the Photo Station app. Um, so you can view your existing photo albums. So these are just some shots that I've taken for articles on Tech Made Easy recently. And you can pinch to zoom and things like that. It's all very well presented. Uh, if I just come out of that, you can also uh, upload files directly from your device, uh, create a new album, and then upload pictures from your camera roll or your photo stream. Uh, and then you've got uh, DS Cam, which is a uh, app for accessing the surveillance station uh, software on your on your uh, Synology NAS. Uh, so you've got a, a web camera here in uh, infrared mode in my living room because the lights are off. Uh, and that's a live feed. You can also look at events that have uh, transpired. So I've got mine set to motion tracking. So these are all events that have occurred when some movement has occurred. There's my feet. I've been probably watching telly or something. And you can also look at any snapshots that you've you've taken of your camera. Also from the main live view pane you can elect to take a snapshot using this button in the top right corner so I'll take a snapshot there missed that take a snapshot and it saves it and will then be viewable in the snapshot finder there and the last app is DS Video which is probably the best app that's available um, this app interfaces with the video station portion of uh, your Synology disk station. Uh, it allows you to view all of your media that's stored on it with uh, information that scrapes from sources like IMDB and the TVDB. Uh, so just to show you, if I select a movie here, it gives you a bio of the movie, uh, gives you a lot of information about it there, and if you were to press that button it would play it. Now, it will only play back files that will natively play back on your device. So on the iPad, uh, that's limited to MP4 files that are encoded as M4Vs, uh, which unfortunately most of my files are not encoded at the moment. Just to show you, it will also do TV shows. You can scroll through your library there. And it will load artwork as you go through. If I select an individual TV show, it will show you a bio of the TV show and then all the actual episodes that you've got and if you select an episode it will show you a thumbnail for the episode and a bio for it. Uh, now this file uh, I've actually re-encoded uh, so that it will play on this device 
So if I just press play there. And it will stream straight across your home network from your LAN, uh, from your NAS drive onto your mobile device. Uh, again, will work over the internet, just needs a little bit of configuration. Probably the easiest way to do it for all these apps is to make use of the VPN functionality that's built into DSM. Uh, and then you can just uh, set up a VPN on your mobile device and access all of these uh, services as if you're on your local network. So there you go guys, uh, a whole bunch of apps that are available for Synology disk stations, uh, be it whether you need to access your music or your video or your photos, uh, access your security camera or just find your device and browse files on it. Thanks for watching guys.